welcome to ImageJ Pro. This is the first installment of ImageJ 101, a crash course in how to use ImageJ. In this first installment, we'll cover downloading and installing Fiji. Before we talk about Fiji, let's talk about what is ImageJ. ImageJ was released by the NIH in 1997 as an open source Java platform for processing and analyzing scientific images. It's very popular with scientists in all fields and particularly popular with microscopists. ImageJ also has a rich community of users who've developed thousands of plugins for a huge number of applications, but this can be daunting, and this is where Fiji comes in. Fiji, which can be found at fiji.sc, stands for Fiji is just ImageJ. What is it meant by that? Fiji really is just ImageJ, but pre-packaged with thousands of different plugins, which are highly popular, validated, and incredibly useful for the standard user. So this is why Fiji is usually referred to as a batteries included distribution of ImageJ. When you go to fiji.sc, You'll be presented with a download link at the very top, which should be automated for the operating system on your computer. But if you need another version of it, you can click this drop down here and you see that Fiji is packaged for all of the popular operating systems, Windows, Mac, and Linux. Once you download Fiji, it'll download as a simple zip file, which I've already downloaded for this video. And I've already unzipped here. And all that's inside of it is one folder that contains every component of the software necessary for operating Fiji. It's not a standard sort of installation uh, where you download an executable and it installs as uh, a package on your computer, but rather everything is self-contained within this folder and you're simply going to run everything off of this imagej-win64.exe or whichever name is for your appropriate operating system. So to actually install Fiji, all you're going to do is take this fiji.app folder which is contained within that zip file and drop it into a folder where you'll find it and use it repeatedly. For me, I like to drop this onto the local disk where it's just gonna live here with all of my other uh, top level folders. So to start Fiji, all you do is open up this folder and double click the executable. For the first opening, it can take a little while on slower systems, but on the average system, it, it should be relatively quick. Uh, so this is what it looks like, and if you want to keep it around as a, a toolbar link, you can pin it over here. But this is the entire software. So everything that you're going to need is contained within either this uh, context menu here, or within these subfolders for adjusting image contrast, processing, finding edges and binary, analyzing uh, different levels of co-localization or setting scale bars, plugins to do cell counting, or a huge number of other op uh, options. We're gonna cover this in subsequent videos, uh, but for now, let's just get going with downloading and installing the software. I hope this was helpful. Uh, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.